Adventures right around the bend. And the world's got wonders to spare. Prehistoric lore to restore and befriend. So get out there, go if you dare. If you dig enough, you'll see. There's power all that time. Wondrous and thunderous creatures to free. Hit the road and give us soar. It's your moment to shine. Yo, what's good YouTube? Welcome back to Fossil Fighters Frontier in 3D. Thank you guys for joining me here as always. And I appreciate that you guys have checked out the first three videos. Welcome to part four, everybody. I'm excited to begin this. Are you guys ready? And uh, on last episode, we left off with Roland. And uh, he wanted us to go to Paradise Beach. Another thing you guys notice now that I have a bottom screen attached. Because y'all asked for that bottom screen. Y'all getting it, everybody. So we're going to go ahead and go to Paradise Beach. Let's go. Okay, how the heck do I... Oh, right, gotta go on the bone buggy. Almost forgot about that. Alright, so he wants us to go to Paradise Beach. Because Roland is our partner for the Warden Test. And uh, I don't know how good he's going to turn out to be. Hopefully, he will not mess up any of our uh, Warden Test. We'll see. Alright. Welcome back to Paradise Beach. Where are you, Roland? I've been waiting for you, Jura. It looks like they opened up a new area. Let's get out there, find some fossils, and take on all comers. We're going to be a great team, or at least you will. I'll probably just be adequate. Yeah, uh, Roland. Lazy bum, he's gonna make us do all the work. Okay, so... What does he want us to do again? Like, I'm not really sure what he wants us to do. But... Oh, wait, wait, let's go to hints right now. I want to see, excavate fossils. And battle root source at paradise. Oh, okay, so he wants us to just fight some dinosaurs. So there's a dinosaur right in front of us. Let's go ahead. Man, I keep calling them dinosaurs. My bad. They're vivasaurs. Vivasaur. I gotta practice saying that. Vivasaur. V i v o s a u r. Okay, let's go. How do I how do I fight him again? Oh, with the L button. Okay. Do you want to see what's on top of that cliff, Jura? Good fossils are often found in hard to reach places. Maybe we should try following those energy spheres. Yeah, that's what I was kind of doing. I guess uh, he wants us to fight, follow the white stuff. And where the heck is that dinosaur? I don't get it. Okay, um, let's go follow this white stuff. All right, we're going to go jump off on this big cliff right here. And that's a boost. Try to hit jump it. Oh, man. How am I supposed to get there at full speed? Well, how the heck am I supposed to get there? get there on his full speed I don't understand okay let's try this again like this is the fastest I can go this is the fastest I can go like I don't know how fast I'm supposed to go let's try this again and we ain't gonna make that <laughs> oh man that's horrible okay let's try this again okay we're gonna I think we have to get more white stuff before we can ever jump in on those ramps um, because my car's too slow, and obviously this white stuff is making us go faster. Hey, look! What's that thing? That's a service station. At a service station, you can change weather source and refill your support shots. You can also warp to any other station you've previously visited in the same dig site. I highly recommend that you access all service stations you encounter. So we should always stop at them when we come across them, huh? Got it! By the way, you don't have, will have to worry about refilling my support shots, Jura. I'll do it myself before every battle. Am I handy or what? Dude, that's not my responsibility. It my, ain't my responsibility to, you know, feed you or change your diapers, Roland. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead. I guess this is like the gas station in a way. Move to another station, change. Okay, let's go refill the support shots. So this is like the gas, you know, I guess of a car. But instead, you're filling up your supports. Alright, let's keep driving on, because, you know, we would have to explore this entire island. I don't think we have seen everything on Paradise Island. And I hate how slow this car goes. I swear, I need a faster car. Hopefully, they have new cars for us to upgrade. Can we fight him? Let's go ahead and fight him. See what happens. Why not? So, this guy's name's Edifo or something like that. Oh, Roland is with us. Interesting, he's got the blue dinosaur. 
Next, I'll explain how turn order works. At the start of a round, the speed of each Vivasaur is examined. This is known as a speed check. The Vivasaurs on each team are then positioned in order with the fastest among them appearing on the left. Check the battle grid on the bottom screen after a speed check to see how your team has been placed. Ready? The battle's about to begin! Okay. Roland, you better have my back! Allow me to share some more battle information. The number is your fossil power or FP. Vivasaurs consume FP in order to use skills. FP is recharged automatically whenever your turn comes up. Okay, I see. The FP required for each skill is displayed on a skill panel. Be sure to keep an eye on your FP at all times when planning out your battle strategies. Good luck! Okay, I see. So we are using 40 FP, we got 50, so that should be fine. Let's go ahead and attack up! Take this son of a gun down! 36 HP. Now, FP plus activated, what's that? Okay, so Edifo is attacking us. And he's... the 25, damn! He did more than us. Happy charge, 50 damage, wow. Looks like this Roland dinosaur does a lot of damage, man. 39, damn. Okay, good job, Roland. That was all to you. Didn't think that uh, you were going to be that useful. <laughs> but uh, I guess ours is like a baby dinosaur. He looks more grown up. Okay, let's get going on. The entire island. And uh, let's pick up these white things. I really don't know what the point of collecting these white spheres are. I mean, they kind of seem like they make my car go faster, but then my car resets the speed and goes down slow again. So what the hell is up with that? So let's keep collecting these points because they might be useful later on. And there is an excavation site right here. Fossil located! Dig! Let's go, guys. Let's just hammer everything away. Like I said, I don't think we need to use a drill. I don't know why drill's here, but maybe in the future we might need to use it. Let's go. What the heck's going on? Oh, okay, I see. So it's like a arm right here. What? Yeah, I can't. Look at this. Do you guys see this? There's nothing. Nothing's happening. I'm, I'm hammering this away. And the drill isn't working either. Well, it is kind of. But. I, mean, I got 30 seconds, 7 seconds. Okay, I gotta keep tapping this. Damn it. Okay, so I kind of forgot how to do this, I guess. And I'm almost out of time, hopefully not 30, 30 seconds. Let's try this again. Where is this bone? Okay, looks like I gotta use a drill. The hammer isn't working. What the hell? This isn't working either. Oh my god. We're gonna lose this. Okay, I can kind of see in the top, but I'm out of time, guys. 10 seconds. Okay, I gotta keep chipping this. Damn. Okay, I don't understand really how this works. Oh man, come on, keep hammering away. No! No, we failed. We failed. We failed. Okay, you have to hammer this a lot. Oh my god, I didn't think that it was actually going to be this hard. Like, not hard, but I didn't think you had to hammer that much. Damn it, we lost the fossil for good. We ain't going to get that one back. Okay, so, I mean, it's my first time really doing it, so, you know, whatever. Shit happens, everybody, and, you know, sometimes people just mess up. So, let's go ahead and get off this cliff. The car's flying. Okay. Let's go back on the road. What a failure. Man, I suck at this game, everybody. I suck. But, uh, hopefully it won't happen again. We got another one here. Give me another chance. Give me another chance to catch a Vivasaur. What the hell? Dig. Okay, there we go. Alright, this time I'm going to just hammer everything away. Screw that drill. Screw everything else. I'm going to be hammering that stuff. Let's go examine that. It's arm of a fossil. Look at this one. This is so much easier than the other one. See? I don't understand. Okay, maybe it's because of the terrain. I think if you're higher up, like you're on a cliff, maybe the dirt or the soil is much harder to dig out. There we go. Good. That was so easy. Look at this. The other one was so much harder. Like, what the heck was up with that? Okay, so we got the arm of a dinosaur, or hands, or whatever. A Daffo arm fossil. This is the first fossil you've seen from this Vivasaur, commencing revival. Alright, so Edafo was the guy we just fought. He's gonna be our new member, I guess. Revive them. Yeah, come on! There we go, we got a baby Edafo. A new Vivasaur is now available.
Okay. Awesome. So we got a new Adafos. Okay, let's go backwards. The driving feels a bit clunky in this game, but regardless, I do like this bone buggy idea. Okay, so let's keep going. And over there, we see another support station. Or gas station, as I like to call it. Let's go ahead and... Refill support shots. Should we change the revival stores? We could try using... I think you can only use one at a time, right? Roland. I can change his? Oh, I can see his attacks. That's interesting. Special Trident Spear. Okay, uh, well, I can't change his. Let's go see if we can change Jura too. Yeah, there we go. Let's see. Okay, we changed to Adafo. And we'll see how this goes. So it looks like you can only use one Vivasaur per battle. Maybe this will increase. Because you know we saw in you know the opening and stuff, there's like three dinosaurs attacking at once. But I'm not sure about that. The road looks kind of narrow over there. I think we should try to get through. Uh, Roland? Maybe. Yeah, let's try. Why not, man? Let's go. Oh my god, look at that dinosaur. Oh crap! Uh oh, we, uh, oh my god, I did not want to drive into him. Be sure to check your opponent's element type before starting a fossil battle. To change your Vivasaurs, press X before time expires. Oh, you can also change Vivasaurs in here. Air type Vivasaur. Whatever, I, I don't, I'm not sure how the elements work yet, but uh, I'll figure out the elements later. This guy seems really hard. Look at that, 87 HP. He looks mad as hell. Tarbo. But I think since we got Roland, we should be able to deal with him. He used deadly fangs. Oh my god, I died in one shot. <laughs> we are dead. We are so dead. We're just watching Roland right now because I didn't even get a chance. Uh, maybe Roland has a chance. We'll see. That really sucked. Oh uh, man, 94 damage. He's gonna no, he's not gonna take that up. 46 damage. He's gonna die in the next hit. And we can't escape the battle. So uh we just have to watch them, I guess. Let's go LP recovery heal his health. Maybe he's got a chance. Because I can use the support skills on the uh on Roland's dinosaur, Tricera. Come on, Roland, you can do this. I'm here to help you out, bro. Honey blow activated. Come on, man. You can do this. Let's keep using the LP recovery. We only have two of it left. We gotta go recharge in the support station later on. I think we can do this because Roland's dinosaur is really strong. This Tricera guy. Pretty strong. So let's go LP. We got one more LP recovery. That should be enough. Oh, he missed too. He missed. Alright, take him down. Let's go attack up. And yeah, I think Roland's gonna do this. Wow. I'm gonna turn around, everybody. Looks like the support skills are really, really strong. I like the support skills. You know, you can heal, you can give them attack boost. It's really nice. 44 damage. Alright, one last blow, Tricera. You got this. Let's go attack up. Help you out there. Although he only has 4 HP. That's what I'm talking about, victory, but our poor Adafo has died. Alright, good job, Roland. It's all to you once again. Without you, I would have lost that battle and probably game over. Hey, we gotta rank up. Even if you die, it looks like you get uh, experience points. And uh, our Adafo was leveled up. Support shots are running low. We're filling a service station soon. Okay, yeah. I've used all my LP because you get like 20 LP, which is life point healing. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, there's a fossil to excavate I see on the minimap. I was looking carefully there. But the support skills are really good, so you know, you guys should all use that as much as possible. You got 20 charges too. Let's go dig that up, see which one this is. Alright, I better choose a dinosaur or oh my god, I keep saying dinosaur. I better choose a vivasaur to work with. Because I don't want to keep changing them around. Let's hammer this away. As fast as possible. Alright, come on. Let's go do this. Hammer it away. Let's go. We're almost doing this. Almost doing this. Almost doing this. We're almost at the white bar. Okay. Where do we have to dig up else here? 
Alright, come on, we're all so close. Is there more up here? No, there isn't more up there. Alright, there we go. 75 points, good job. 30 seconds left. Alright. So I wonder if this is the other arm of a Daffo, or maybe another dinosaur. Vivasaur, damn it! Vivasaur! I swear I hate saying the dinosaur now. <laughs> oh, we got Tarbo! Awesome! Tarbo was that guy we just fought. That cool T-Rex kind of guy. Okay, we're gonna change our Vivasaurs because, you know, no offense to that fool, you're cool and all, but you ain't a T-Rex. And we all know the Tyrannosaurus Rex is the coolest dinosaur out there. Although, you know, these are Vivasaurs, but this is a new Vivasaur we got now. Uh, a high power but low accuracy skill. Oh man, that might be bad. He's got low accuracy, that means he's gonna miss a lot. But, he still looks like a beast. And I'm sorry, Adafo, but you look like a uh, PPP. <laughs> I don't know what a, I don't know what a PPP is, but I don't know what I'm saying. But what I'm saying is basically Adafo looks weak, so I wanna I wanna change them. Let's go to the support station and do that right now. X button, change of a source. Uh, I I mean, thank you for your time, Adafo, but you know we gotta go with a stronger one. You know, it's the stronger that survives. Okay, refill the support shots, which we wanna do. And let's exit the station. Okay. Alright, let's continue with our journey, everybody. Oh, man. There's another fossil down there. I don't know. I, I don't think it's necessary to get all these fossils, but... It's probably a good idea. So, you know, you get more options to choose your Vivasaurs. Alright, let's go ahead and excavate this guy and see what dinosaur he is. Vivasaur! Oh, my God. I keep saying dinosaur, guys. I'm so sorry about that. Alert! Fossil battery incoming! What is this? What? Is there a dinosaur that's attacking us? Oh my god. Okay, it looks like somebody's protecting this fossil. Your opponent is a fire-type Rook Vivasaur. Oh my god, I don't, I don't want to change. What's the... Okay, I don't see the type. I mean, I don't see... I don't see what's the point of the elements because I can't see which one is weak to which. They don't tell us... Fire is, is weak to water, you know, grass is weak to, you know, like Pokemon, they're not telling us which is weak to what. Okay, Tarbo. Oh, it's the Rube. Alex says, we fought this guy before. He's pretty easy to take down. Oh my god, 69 damage? What is this? Okay, looks like we're gonna have to rely on Roland all day. Look at these dinosaurs. Vivasaurs, look at these Vivasaurs, they're so tough. Okay, I don't understand. Like... Shouldn't they make these Vivasaurs a little bit easier? Because, you know, we're just starting. <laughs> oh, man. Like, without Roland, I don't know what we could be doing right now. Roland's Tricera is the reason why we're winning right now. Heavy charge, take him down. Take him down, Roland. Oh, wow, you can use more attack up at one time. I didn't realize that. Oh, okay. I keep only using it once. It looks like you can use it more than once. Like, I just used three, three attack up boosts there. Let's go LP. Ah, damn it. I was going to LP recovery, but whatever. Alright, and this should be it. Take him down. Take him down, Tricera. He's got 4 HP, 34 damage. Good job. 9 points. Yay. Now, do we get a level up on our Tarbo or no? Ah, no level up. Okay. Hey, where's the fossil? What the heck? The fossil is gone. The fossil is gone! Oh my god, okay, let's go back to base. Or, let's complete the Paradise Beach rundown. I don't understand, there was a fossil, somebody jumped out. Tried to kill us. But, uh, yeah, the fossil is gone. Alright, I think that's it. Um, let's go back to the Warden's Gate, I guess? Or, yeah, our headquarters, that's what I was trying to say, because... It just doesn't seem to be anything else we can do for now. Okay, let's keep driving on this road right here. And I'm getting bored of Paradise Island. To be honest with you guys, we've been on this island for so long. Like, there better be a new map pretty soon. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's cut into here. Oh my god, where am I going? Where the heck am I going? Okay, let's go to that gate over there. Alright, open up! Okay, wait, 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 wait. This is not the right side. Sandy side, this is still the sandy side. Oh wait, you know what? 
before we go to the warden's gate there's something i see up ahead look at that ramp right there. let's go and try to jump off that thing see what happens gain some speed hey there's a fossil here too let's go dig that up oh my god i see that vivasaur coming us coming at us right in front of it do you see that oh wow well, he didn't want to fight us though Oh my god! Oh god, okay, I see what happened. So, if these Vivasaurs are too close up to you, then your fossil battle gets... I mean, your fossil excavation fails. That's what happens. That's what happens. Oh my god. So it looks like that one also failed. Root A. They're all called Roots, I guess. Okay, please don't kill us in one shot. Tricera's going first. Oh no, he's going first. The butt smash. <laughs> okay, let's go. Do you see how the opposing Vivasaur stance change? Stances may change after using or being hit by certain skills. The damage a Vivasaur takes from an attack can vary greatly depending on what stance it's in. If you notice a Vivasaur shaking on the bottom screen, that means it's in a weak stance. You see opportunity to strike. Oh. The stance your opponent will be in after an attack is indicated by the arrow icons on the skill panel. The blue panel shows your stance while the red panel shows your foes. Stances play an extremely important role in battle so be sure to keep this in mind. Okay, I see. I can't use anything. Not enough FP. I cannot use- okay, so you cannot use any of these attacks if you don't have this fossil since so we only have the tail. We can only use this 85, so we gotta wait. You can't attack, it seems. That really sucks. That really does suck. Maybe it was a bad idea to go with Tarbo. Although Tarbo is a pretty cool guy. Let's go boost that attack. I guess once again, we're gonna have to rely on Roland. We still can't do anything, because we're at 62 FP. Oh, we can do Butt Strike. Oh no, he's doing Butt Strike. Man, I keep seeing the wrong... I keep thinking his attack is mine. Okay, uh, we can go ahead and do a tail bash. And this guy. And his misery. 71 damage. Damn, this turbo guy does a lot of damage. But you need to save up a lot of those FP or fossil points. I guess that's what they call it. Oh well, we lost that fossil once again. But let's go ahead and check this ramp, guys. See where it takes us. Hey, there's another fossil right there. Oh my god. Let's go ahead and excavate that as well. Let's just go ahead and please, no dinosaurs. This, no, no vivasaurs this time, please. Alright, let's go ahead and try digging this up. Alright. Looks like this was the same fossil we had before. Okay, let's keep digging this guy up. Alright, we're pretty close. Pretty close. Let's dig up more up in here on the top. Let's dig that apart. So yeah, you really don't need a drill. Hammer's probably the best way to do this at. I mean, the drill is just too slow, guys. Okay, how far can we dig? Okay, where is this guy? Oh, he's, he's also at the uh, right end here. Let's go ahead and dig that part as well. And we should be pretty good soon. There we go. 66 points. Alright, awesome. I wonder what these points do though. I mean, I still can't figure it out. I know they give you ex experience to your dinosaurs, but it doesn't seem like 60 points is going to my dinosaur. Proto. This is the first fossil you've seen from this Vivasaur. Commencing revival. Oh wow, that's like the Tricera. Looks like a Tricera that Roland had. But it's definitely not a Tricera, it's a Proto. Oh, that's pretty cute. You know what? I might want to use this guy. He looks pretty cute. A new Vivasaur is now available. Uh, a low FP skill that fills boost quickly. Best against downward facing foes. Okay, so he's talking about the stance stuff again. Alright, we're going to end the episode pretty soon. I know this is kind of long, but... I mean, there's so many fossils to explore, guys. There's another fossil right here. Let's go dig that up as well!
Okay, we'll we'll just uh, stop with this fossil, I guess. This will probably be the last thing we do. I just want to see what kind of dinosaurs they are. I want to see what kind of vivasaurs they are. Oh man, I keep seeing dinosaurs over and over again. Okay, let's check this. Okay. Oh wait, it's the same guy. Uh, the guy we just unlocked, Proto. It's the Proto's head. I noticed this uh, fossil shape. All right, let's take that up. Yay! Seventy-four points. I, I'm pretty sure this is Prado, guys. It looks like Prado's uh, head. Yeah, Prado head fossil. That's what I'm talking about. Now we get a new attack skill as well. We have the body and the head of the Prado. Sweet. Prado's rank raised from one to three. Okay. A new skill is now available. All right, let's go back. I wonder when he grows up to adult size. That's what I am interested in. Oh my god, he's coming right at us. Uh, there's a fossil right here, wasn't there? Nope, I don't see any fossil. Oh my god, no! And he's fighting us. Your opponent is water type. I'm gonna change, actually, because... Let's go ahead and try using Prado anyways. This is a great chance to see what this guy can do. Uh, we just saw how powerful Tarbo was, but he has to wait a turn unless you get another part of his fossil. His tail bash took 85 FP. You can't do that in the first turn. All right. Let's see what our, uh, not Tarbo, what's his name again? Proto. Yeah, Proto. Let's see what Proto can do. FP plus activated. Dome dash or spin drop? Let's go ahead and try spin drop. Attack up. Let's go ahead and give him two 65 damage. Damn, this guy is strong, guys. Strong, strong for a little kid dinosaur. Kid Vivasaur, not kid dinosaur, I keep saying. I know, I know I keep making the mistake with dinosaurs and vivasaurs, but I'm liking this guy. I, I think I'll keep Prado uh, as my main vivasaur for now, unless something better comes up. But he seems pretty damn strong, and I don't have to wait a stupid turn to attack like Tarbo. But yes, there is a fossil. Sorry, guys. This is going to be like 30 minutes, but we need to go ahead and get every fossil. I, I, I just can't end the episode like this, you know? You know what I'm saying, everybody? This game is pretty fun, so let's go ahead and dig. This is going to be the last one, I promise everybody, this is going to be the last one, but uh, let's see if this is another part of Prado's body. Nope, it's not, it's somebody else's body. Let's go ahead and see. So this is going to be a new Vivasaur to unlock. Wow, so many Vivasaurs today. So many choices, I'm still wondering what the elements, what the purpose of the elements are. I mean, it, it, it would probably work like Pokemon, right? You know, like fire weak to water. But I don't know where my, I don't know what the real purpose is. I'm going to have to find out later. Alright, so who is this? Who is this? Sungari. So we got the body of Sungari. Oh, it's a flying! Flying Vivasaur. Oh my god, that's so cool. Maybe we should use this guy. <laughs> I don't know, guys. So many Vivasaurs to choose from. This guy's pretty cool. Look at him. Sungari. New Vivasaur is now available. A low FP, high accuracy skill. Best against forward facing foes. See, I mean, what's the point of elements? I don't see any elements on him. Like, is he a fire type, water type? Like, what's the point? Okay, but thank you guys for watching this once again. And uh, yeah, like I said, I promise to end here. This is going to be like a 30 minute episode. I know it's long. Sorry about that. But you know, there's just so much things to explore on this Paradise Island. And that guy's coming right at us. So we're going to go and get the hell out of here. Because I just don't feel like fighting him right now. But thank you guys once again for watching this. I'll be back with- Oh my god, there's another fossil here. There's another fossil here. Sorry guys, I gotta I gotta go dig this one up. This is gonna be the last one, I promise. This is gonna be the last one I dig up. I know there's gonna be more on this island, but... I don't know, I feel like I should show you everybody. Oh my god, look at this guy. The head is long. Oh, I think it's the head of the... Sungari. I can tell by the long head shape. I think this is part of Sungari's body. Alright. This is really good, this is really good. Come on. Come on, man, let's keep tapping that, tapping that hammer, tapping that hammer. We got his, uh, beak, or his mouth almost coming up here. Alright, come on. Gotta get a little bit more of the top head right here. There we go! Okay, I think this is Sungari's head. I'm pretty sure this is Sungari's head. Please tell me it's Sungari's head. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Yeah, Sungari head just as I thought. Alright, Sungari gets a new skill now. 
All we need is his wings and body. Oh, I mean, we got the body, but we need his wings and something else. Sungari's rank rose from 2 to 3. And your skill's now available. Yay! Okay. Alright, guys. Like I promised, this is gonna be the last part. That was the last part. But uh, we unlocked... I think I'll be using Prado and Sungari because I have the head and the body fossil for them right now. Uh, thank you guys for watching this. Once again, I'll be back with part 5. Thank you guys for checking this out. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. See you, everybody. Have fun. And peace out.